once again I see my confidence is shaking and my heart is feeling vacant So you try to fill it in You said I could fix a broken in your heart Welcome to my channel um welcome back um if you've already been here but i'm gonna do an unboxing and i just have to go get the rest of the groceries out of the car but these delivered yesterday and it didn't notify me so i just found them today i got my rec specs i'm not showing the label thing and i got a new vest i believe this is my new vest um seems really big in this package but yeah anyways i think this is mine yeah it is Oh yeah, I'll unbox that once I get my rest of the stuff and so see you when that happens. And then Dixie will test them out for you guys. Oh, and also, um, I'm just going to tell you guys what we got so it's not a shocker. We got Rex Specs and um, a Medium One Tigress Apollo 09 new vest for me. Anyways, why is the bread on? Sorry. I have all my fruits and stuff out here that I have to get. So yeah, I'll put these in the back of the HUV and carry them back up. Okay, anyway, so sorry if you hear creaking. I have to sit on the toilet because this is the only good filming spot. Um, and I always do my unboxings here, so I changed it up last minute, you know. So I bought these with my own money. So no, I did not beg my parents for these. I bought them with my own money that I was gifted with. I was been saving up for a really long time to get these things. So yeah, just really excited that I could afford this. So yeah, so. Plus, I have a garbage right here, so that's really nice. We have my One Tigress. It comes in this nice bag. I've ordered a One Tigress before, so I know I'm going to like this. Um, this will probably be our new vest for the fair. Um, so, yeah, I just got to oops, gotta slide it out this way, I think. Okay. That's looking pretty nice. Okay. I see you, One Tigress. Oh, I just fell on this thing. The toilet seat is not good. Not good. Just sit on. Um, so yeah, I, they just have their normal tags. Um, I'm not seeing anything different. So yeah, um, this is the vest. It's just normal one tigress quality, very good quality. Probably I'm not gonna say poor quality, but my older vest is a little bit better quality than this one. Um but that's just my preference because I think it's thicker, so that's why this one's thinner, so it feels a lot more, like, less, you know, um, quality, if you want to put it that way. Um, the vest, the first vest I got, Dixie, was One Tigress, and I don't think they make them anymore, so I'm glad I got it when I did. Um, so yeah, let me just look at these real quick. Nothing I'm missing, right? No, nope. looks pretty good. Okay, so I gotta clip that off. I don't have scissors in here, though. Um, so yeah, I got a medium because Dixie wears a medium. So yeah. Um, actually, I can clip this right off. That's actually a pretty nice feature. I think I can at least. There we go. Yeah. You can just you can just clip the tags off. They have a little clip. So I don't know if you want to keep them for whatever reason. You can just clip them back on. But I'm gonna throw them away because I don't want tags on my vest. Um, we have the classic one tigers patch. Um, I guess I'll just put it on there. I don't know. Um, yeah, I'll just put it on there. Never mind. So yeah, um, I'll try that on Dixie in a little bit. We have pockets, which, oh my gosh, lifesaver. We have a little pouch for what I assume like a, a Velcro pouch at that, um, which I assume ID card for I don't know, like police badge maybe, I'm, I'm guessing. Uh, or you could put ADA law cards in here. So I think that's what I'm going to do. Um, I'm going to put the pouch somewhere. But I love this nice back of Velcro with the D-rings. Um, I love this so much. Um, very nice quality. Very nice Velcro. Um, the, I love new Velcro. Um, so yeah, um, I'm going to put this back on here. I got to find where the... Okay, there's it. 
I'm gonna put the like little pouch at the end of the vest. So yeah, um, we got that. I'm sorry for the poor quality. Let me close this blind so you guys can see a little bit better. So we'll get back up. There we go. Can you guys see it better now? So yeah, um, it's considered the short version. It's still a very long vest, so I'm glad I didn't get the long version because I feel like that would be way too long. Um, just set it on the floor. Let me redo my hair and then we'll open the Rex specs. I've never had Rex specs before, so this might be a little bit exciting. I thought I would be more excited, but it's just packaged and I shouldn't get so excited over packages every time I get them. Um, so yeah, make sure not to show my address, but just open this tape. I don't have a knife or scissors in here, so I'm doing it with my hands and the tape isn't that hard to get off, so score. This is harder than it looks. <laughs> Normally I can get tape off really easy, like right here. I can just tear it off if I can. I can barely get it. Is there a knife in here? I don't think we have a knife. No, we do not. <laughs> oh, sorry guys. Um, I might need one. <laughs> I might need a knife. I don't know who one is though. I could use that. I'm sorry, I'm looking at things I could use, but Anyways, Ooh. whatever. <laughs> so much for saving the box. I just ripped off the whole dark side of that one. Okay, here it is. Good thing it came in a little package because I was going ham on that box for some odd reason. Um, here is my receipt thingy. I'm gonna have to throw this out with fire picks. It's cardboard, so. that in there um i might keep that if they don't fit i'll return them and get whatever size sticks needs but i'm pretty sure they'll fit because i measured them properly oh they come in this nice little casing nice um let me put these up here i am oh they come in a cute little bag that's so cute i'm keeping this bag to put these in okay yeah those definitely look like they would fit Dixie. And I got another lens for protection from the sun and that's actually pretty nice. Um, I'm gonna put this back in here though. Oh, and they come with, um, I think that's a clear lens, I believe. Um, so you get an extra lens. Let me see if they're clear. Yeah, that's clear. I'm sorry, I couldn't really tell. Um, I'm not sure how you get these out though. Okay, so I think I know how to put this on. I think I'm gonna have to read the instructions, but I'm gonna do some desensitization. It is very lightweight. Like this is super lightweight. I thought it'd be a lot heavier for some reason. So yeah, um, hopefully Dixie will like these. Um, I gotta remove this sticker that's on the lens real quick. Ooh, that's a really nice sticker. Good thing it did stick. I. Now that I'm thinking about it, I probably should have kept that one tiger's bag to put my thing in. Oh well, I will add it to my collection. Um, so yeah, that looks pretty nice actually. I don't really see the hype about these. I just got them for protection, but people are like, oh, amazing quality. But if I'm being completely honest, Rick Specs, um, the straps kind of feel cheap, if that makes any sense. Um... Just like the foam and stuff kind of feels cheap. Um, but I bet they will fit wonderful on my dog and protect her. And that's the reason I got them. They look very small, but they will fit her head. So yeah, I'm going to go try these things on. So see you when I do that. So I'm desensitizing her to them. Let me see if I can get these all set up. I'll move over a little bit. Through. Yes. Good done this a couple times yes good um sometimes if i want them on longer i'll just hold it there good yes 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 good we're almost out of bread pieces so i'm gonna try it this on one yes good job um i gotta try to figure out how to get the lens out because i don't know how to do that yet um and i tried watching a tutorial and mine are not flexible so <laughs> It's kind of difficult to pop them out, so yeah, anyways. Yes! 
good. Yes. Now she's doing it because she thinks it's fun. Yes. Good. Good. Can I put them on your head? Oh, look at you. What was that one? Get back, Beak. All out of bread. But yeah, um, through. Yes. Through. Yes. Good job. Good girl. Good job. Yeah. Get out of there, you hog face. We don't have any more in there. No, we don't. She's touching glasses because she's like, I want them. I want them. For the vest, she knows best, but um, I'm just trying to get these her comfortable these She's sniffing the camera. Get over here, Dixie. Dixie, you bite. Come here. Good. Yeah. Here is Dixie. I put some of our patches. It's kind of being weighed down because I put poop bags in the side. But our patches that we got from a custom shop say Service Wolf. We got Medical Alert. Do not distract. We are a team forever. I'm not here for your entertainment. I'm here to do my job. Medical Alert Service Dog. Not all displays are visible. I had to put that one sideways. And then we have our ADA Law Cards put in this little pouch. And they have zippers that go down to butt right there, which is pretty spacious for me. So, yeah. And then they have cape clips, um, D-rings, and yeah. They actually added like a little front to make her more comfortable. So, she doesn't mind it, obviously. She's kind of gear shy. So, yeah. Come here. So she's kind of slow on it, but she doesn't mind. She doesn't find it uncomfortable. So that's amazing. So yeah, thanks one tigress. Oh yeah, and here's the finished look with her goggles. She's so traumatized. Ripka, you're in the way. Move, move, move your butt. So <laughs> my dad's washing outside. Sorry for that. Those are all our groceries I needed to put away, but I think her goggles are pretty cool. She actually does not mind them. Come here. Yes. Oh. She's not dragging on the ground. It's so good. Good girl. Anyways, yeah. At this point, I think Dixie's fully desensitized. Her ears aren't back. She comes. She obeys. She listens. I took out some treats and tried to do it with her. So, heel. Come here. Heel. Yes, sit. Good. Yes. Good job. Good. And then we take it off right after short training sessions and good girl so she doesn't actually mind them which is really good so her desensitization is basically done we probably have to do some walkies and stuff make sure she doesn't drag on the ground because i bet she would not like it but i did what they said but the only thing is they told me to take out these lens and put them on put them on the dog first without the lens but i couldn't take them out so but she's fine with clear lens um it's just a shaded lens i'd probably freak her out but Clear lens, she's all good with. She's worn sunglasses before, and she didn't mind them, so these aren't no different besides they go around, like, her face right here. So, yeah, anyways, um, I'll take pictures from my Instagram, so if you want to go see pictures of her in the vest and the goggles, uh, go on my Instagram.